You've seen these. They're called hoarding boards, and they're a common sight at our meeting places. They announce the exciting arrival of new shops and experiences that will grow our destination's offers. When the shop opens, the hoarding materials are dismantled and discarded. The hoarding board that we use is plywood and for the visual is tarpaulin. The plywood, we always manage to find a way to recycle just by reusing it. But the tarpaulin already has printing, so it's impossible for us to use it for another company. It's usually destroyed and ripped apart and the ink is totally not recyclable. Usually, in all the shopping centres in Malaysia, all these visuals is actually goes to landfill. The printed materials that have been discarded over the years is enough to cover four football fields. With sustainability a key priority at Econo centres, we are constantly on a mission to tackle waste, to find new ways to inspire and enable our partners and communities to reduce their impact on the planet. We wanted to give the hoarding materials a new life, upcycling them into tote bags. We need workers to turn them into tote bags. The most challenging part is finding the NGOs. It took me quite some months and then we found Women of Will. So Women of Will is an NGO which was founded with the primary objective of empowering low-income women as well as their communities supporting them to start their own businesses, developing them into community leaders, as well as developing their confidence, their personality and other skill sets. All hoarding materials will be carefully dismantled by our contracted partner and delivered to Women of Will Sewing Centre. Here, the women prepare the materials and sew them into unique tote bags. This process will contribute to their monthly income. Usaha kerjasama yang bagus terutama untuk environment. Dengan adanya kerjasama dengan dengan Ikano, sedikit sebanyak ianya membantu kami menambah keberdapatan. The tote bags are then made available to our visitors as part of our efforts to promote a sustainably driven lifestyle. Sustainability is much more than just a buzzword. I think sustainability is the way we develop our business in a much more people and planet friendly way. This effort to develop new ways to reduce our carbon footprint is just the start. A small but significant step towards building sustainability, empowering lives, and inspiring our partners and communities to create meaningful impact.